Okay, it's Sunday, July 14th. I'm leaving Spire. Had a really good night here. Um, the old town's back there. I camped a couple miles that way. And this is a, I showed this kind of yesterday. It's a cool park. It's got an IMAX. And it's got all these old planes. There's a 747 right there um, on stilts or something. And I think you can go up and walk around in them, but I don't know why anyone would want to do that. It's seeing the outside that's actually cool. I don't think the GoPro does it justice with the wide angle lens, but um, very cool. So today is Strasbourg, France, that way. Okay, we're in Gersheim, Germany, and very nice. All these towns seem to look the same. Very nice streets with houses. No commerce anywhere almost, but I know it's Sunday, so stuff's closed anyway. So, but I thought I'd give you a glimpse of Gersheim in case you're ever in the area and want to check it out. Hey, we're playing our morning game. Will they wave and say hello? Hello. Ooh, I got a hello that time. Excellent. I'm 50-50 I'm this morning which is good. This is the back on the Rhine in Gersheim. Very pretty this town. It's a univers uh, university town. I caught a break today. Um, I'm drafting this guy with a motor. He said it was okay. It's a big headwind coming up the Rhine. I'm doing like 14 or 15 miles an hour. I usually do like 12. That's so much easier. I read somewhere that on a long trip like this without hills, aerodynamics is so much more important than weight. And I can see it now. So I thought this was interesting. I heard you're only supposed to have one set of swans on every body of water. But I see one pair right there. And then there's three there. So I don't know if that's like a triple group or there's, it looks like the two. And then that one guy probably doesn't have a mate. But it's interesting how they're all together here on this one little body of water. So you always know when it's Saturday when you're either on a hike or on a bike ride because there's always so many more people out and I don't mean it in a bad way, actually a good way, it's just more people to, to engage with, people watch, whatever, but certainly, uh, well actually same thing with Sunday, today's Sunday, but same difference. Anyway, this has been a little bit away from the river today. This has been uh, um, kind of the backdrop for today. This kind of big cycle path with these fields. And it must be close to a city because so many people are out today. But anyway, nice day again and uh, give you view of whatever I'm looking at. Okay, I hit my 30 miles before lunch, so target accomplished. Still out in the farmlands, and I am now going to find a shady place for lunch. Don't know if you can see this, but check out the bottom of that guy's Alright, guess what? I don't know if you can see that. Right there where my finger is. It says France. So, be in France in a mile or two. Goodbye Germany. It was nice knowing you. Whoa. 
So this is my first experience with this. I hope I see more in France. It's called Storage Market. And look at all the good stuff they have. Everything from uh, all that stuff to all that stuff. I'm not sure if it's hot or some some is hot and some's cold. Anyway, we'll see what we get. So check this out. I'm already enjoying France. I'm having a crepe with chocolate and bananas and beautiful stuff along the, the river. Hey, there's my crepe. I'm really enjoying myself in France so far. There's still a lot of Germans here, but it should be. It's only a couple miles over the border. Okay, so I'm in camp. I did about 52 miles today. I'm about 20 miles uh, north of Strasbourg, France. And But I'm definitely in France, and I had my first crepe in the first two miles, so that's all good. There's the campsite for the night. Right there and everything, blah, blah. And I'm at a pretty cool site. I wasn't sure I'd like this place, but it's kind of like a beach resort. I guess I should know if that's the Rhine or a lake, but I don't. Um, anyway, a lot of people here for the day that'll clear out soon, but there's a couple people camping and, and there's a whole like RV kind of park back there. And right across the road there, is a restaurant so I have plenty of food but of course they said everything was going to be closed in Germany on Sunday but I guess not in France so anyway tomorrow will be exciting um, I'm gonna spend a few hours in Strasbourg it's supposed to be a beautiful city and I'll try to take some video okay so thanks for watching whoever's out there